Hello guys, my name is Mohamed Ali and welcome back to Coding Cafe. So in the previous video tutorial we have created this profile activity and now we will work on that. So go to the activity profile XML file here text and now first of all change this constant uh, layout to the relative layout. And now here uh, basically first of all let me tell you this background image will be available in the the link to this will be available in the description down below you can simply download this from there okay and give it a name profile activity then you can simply cut this okay from here and now let's come here to the drivable folder show in explorer and go to the drivable folder and paste that here and now here we need to first of all by mistake this is not changed to the relative layout so make sure to change this to relative layout okay and now here we can add a background and it is inside the drawable folder by the name profile activity you can see that okay now we need a circle image view to display the image of the user and it should be 200 dp and the height should be 200 dp align parent top to true center horizontal should also be true so that it should be at the center then margin top should be 110 dp let's add a source to it which is inside the drawable folder by the name profile image you can see that it looks beautiful now let's give it some id to this so the id for this will be visit underscore profile underscore image then we need a text view match parent wrap content and let's give it a text it should be username and it should be below the uh, profile image so we can copy the ID of that and we will pass that here and after that margin left layout margin left should be 15 dp and layout margin right should also be 15 dp margin from the top should be 5 dp text alignment should be at the center text all caps false text size at ESP text style should be bold now we need to display the profile status so you can simply copy this text view and pass that down here and we will change it for that first of all make sure to uh, give id to the username which will be wizard underscore user underscore name and now the id for the profile status will be wizard underscore profile underscore status and it should be the same and here we can change the text hey i'm using coding cafe chat app and now this should be below the uh, username so copy this and change replace here okay you can see this the text size for it will be 25 sp and from the top it should be 25 dp and then we need a send message button here so let's create a button here so we can say a button match parent wrap content let's get id first so it will be send underscore message underscore button or instead of that we can give it send message request button and then after that it should be below the 
profile status margin top 5 dp and margin left layout margin left 65 dp and from the right it should also be 65 dp text color at the red and right and background light let's add a background to it so the background will be the buttons okay text style should be bold text size should be 20 sp and now let's add a text to this button and it should be send message and text all caps should be false let's move it little bit below so from the top it should be 10 dp so yeah that's it for this video and in the next video tutorial we will define and cast these fields on our profile activity.java file and then we will retrieve the user information here and after that we will allow a user to send a message to the other users but this will not be a direct message i mean just like you guys see in whatsapp when you receive a message request from an unknown person okay then you have a choice either you have to accept that uh, chat or you can cancel that chat I mean once you agree to the chat request then you both can uh, be able to chat with each other and then that person will be added in your contact list so yeah that's it for this video and see you guys in the next video bye for now